Hello everybody, welcome to another video and today I'm going to try to show uh, a workaround with Vermilion and not really leaving your Oculus like if you don't have a laptop or a computer or even a phone, who knows. But this is a workaround to stay in your Oculus and still get references. I'll point out that as much as I want to use the browser and grab references and save it to this to this file system over here it doesn't work but there is something that does work and it's kind of just silly so Pinterest doesn't work on my end for Vermilion but I can bring it up in this browser so if I want to gather some references before I start painting or go around what I can do is open up Dropbox if you have a Dropbox account you can load up for a free one just and you should be able to get something or even something similar but I'm able to bring Dropbox into Vermilion so you can see some references that I've grabbed on the right and what I'll do is just go into say for instance this is a good little example I like it um, you can go down here and go to download once you download your image it'll go to your oculus and you can actually see it right here I think I clicked it twice uh, we can grab another one. Say, for instance, you want to do some uh, tutorials like this. We'll download this one. And next. And we'll grab one more just for reference. So, say, for instance, you want to do a stylized image right here. It's another one. Download image. Click. Close this. So, these images are now, um, they should be in my file system. So if I go to my downloads, let's see if it's there. So you got your first one, your second one, and the other one should be downloading now if it didn't already or it's at the bottom. It doesn't matter. Either way, these two examples will help. I'm going to go over to this Dropbox window, and we can go to Upload. We should be able to grab File, and we're going to go back into our file system, and now you should be able to see everything that you want. So I can click the first image. This should be able to select it and upload. Go to the next one. We're gonna see if it'll do two files at once. Sometimes the internet's slow in the morning. I don't know which one I grabbed. I think the top one. So we'll grab this one. We'll select it. And these will go to over here, and then you can see that it's uploading. So now, after these upload, we can go into Vermilion and box and then these images that we've just uploaded to this little folder um, should be there and it looks like it uploaded one let's see what the other one uploaded to uploaded and it might only let me do one at a time but either way this is there and we can do the other one if we need to but let's go to vermilion either way we got the one I didn't head it up on the other. Let's go to Vermilion. All apps should be at the top. And let's open up our program. Because I was kind of frustrated trying to get Pinterest to work in here. And then the browser's kind of um, uh, restricting looking at, uh, I guess, Pinterest. And I like Pinterest. There's a lot of good references, a lot of good things in there. And so from there. And let's see if I'm not like right inside of the canvas I started grabbing references and so I started going back and forth with this and using that technique so you can see that I've already started with some of the references I've grabbed so if I go into here it's gonna start loading and my Dropbox is already loaded and it's already from my previous session and it was trying to paint these cherries that you see here but let's go back one so you can see this was one of my references and we'll go back and let's go down um, and this is the one we grabbed from our browser so now we should be able to see this we can see it zoomed in we can open this up a little bit bigger we can probably grab the edges and see if it'll go bigger bigger that's the max size but what we can do is zoom in we can actually do this and then zoom in even more so if you want to follow this example and start painting along you can do this and start your go from there go to the next one and start getting your your images going so this is a workaround it's not perfect but it works so as long as I can get my images in here 
and you can see I grabbed some still life. And they even went to um, uh, Discord. And I think, oh, I did this from the computer. So when I go to Discord, I just drag and drop into my Dropbox. But this is something that I like that the AI, the, if you look, find Mid Journey AI, this was one of the references that I was going to do. And I love that the AI is so good with color and everything. So that's something that I wanted to pull, just do another canvas. But these, this is kind of kickstarted back up in my, my references because I was kind of like trying to go on this search engine but when you know where you want to find your references and Pinterest is perfect for references and that's where I was going this is a little Halloween one and so this is where I ended up with the cherries and I was going to go with these little um, this for reference so hopefully this helps get a little work around trying to get you get you going with this art I love this program and so we're so, so in so many words it, so many words is uh if there's a will there's a way and that's pretty much i'm kind of i was just kind of digging around online trying to find a way i did something similar with gravity sketch i have another video out there if you do gravity sketch from not leaving your oculus and doing the same kind of process but you upload to uh the their their cloud and it works similar so hopefully this helps and just you know keep painting have a good day Thanks for watching.